What's going on, Infinite Fam? Welcome back to another video. It's your girl Janice and Nene. Hey, baby. <laughs> if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and join the family. So, guys, Blooper and I have an amazing prank to do on Isaiah today. So, Isaiah right now is in the shower. So, I have to make this intro quick because we are about to go to my cousin's house. So, I got this idea to tell him that I liked him better in high school. Ooh. Now, guys, of course, when you first start dating, you're like lovey dovey and you're all cute and cuddly towards each other. But as you get older, as you get older that starts to change and of course isaiah and i still love each other so much but we're just not kids anymore and i feel like he is going to be like what do you mean by that like why are you saying that to me i still love you and i don't know i think it's gonna be a hilarious prank to do on him so guys if you're ready for today's video don't forget to smash that like button and comment team janice in the comment section below and let's get this prank started What's going on, Infinite Fam? Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell, leave a positive comment down below for a chance to get a hua. For a chance to get a shout out in the next video. That is right, guys. So today we're going to be going over to Janice's cousin's house. Janice's cousin is nine years old. He got a PC and I got to basically build it. He's actually 10. He's going to watch this and be very mad at you, but yeah. I highly doubt he even cares. But <laughs> guys, for those of you who don't know what a PC is, it basically stands for personal computer. Um, a lot of people now are getting them for like gaming setups and all that. Her cousin is a gamer. Um, if he's watching this, boy, yeah. you're trash. <laughs> and yeah, so I'm going to go build it. I have no idea what I'm doing, but we're going to go vlog it out over there and it mm -hmm. should be fun. Yeah, so I think it'll be really funny if I record the whole process because Isaiah honestly doesn't know what he's doing. I knew you were going to say that. And it's going to be really funny to see him frustrated or like conflicted and not know what to do. And yeah, Guys, we're going to just see the whole process. I get very aggravated when I'm like trying to follow instructions or I'm trying to build something or do something and it's not coming out the way I want. I feel like mm -hmm. that's normal though for someone to get aggravated. Um, yeah, it kind of is, but like Isaiah will not stop until he finishes. Yeah. Like, Isaiah is so determined with whatever he does, he'll be in one place for literally hours and hours, probably a whole day. I don't know if that's good or bad though, because I feel like that shows like I don't know what I'm doing. Not, <laughs> not really. Like, it just it's a good and a bad thing. Bad thing because you don't eat or anything, but like, good thing this because, like, you know, you. Yeah, That's I don't quit. I don't quit. But before we go over there, guys, we're going to be going to Starbucks. Yes, I know you guys haven't heard that in a while because we've been hitting the gym and getting strong and whatnot. But today we're going to Starbucks because I feel like it. So Yeah, and I'm like really, really tired. And I was like so tired today taking naps and stuff. So yeah, we're going to get something to energize us. Yeah, enough talking. All right, guys, so we got the Starbucks. We're chilling in front of Janice's cousin's house now. Your boy got the mango dragon drink fire without the inclusions because the inclusions began stuck in the little hole right here. I know that sound wrong, but it prevents me from drinking my drink and it's really annoying. But yeah, that's what I got with the blueberry muffin. And I got the healthiest possible matcha green tea latte. Fact, this is my first time ever having a venti drink. Okay. Guys, that is basically grass in a cup. It's good. Don't be coming for my matcha. If you ever want to know what grass tastes like, Grass no. in a cup, long clippings. That's Mata exactly is that fire. is. fire. You know what? You want to talk about something? Let's talk about the fact that I paid for all of this. <gasps> wow. You're going to expose me like yes, that? Yes, I am. The one time I forget my wallet. Uh, this is exactly why I miss when you were in high school because this would never have happened if we were in high what school. What does that even have to do with anything, bro? The one because time I forget my wallet, I shouldn't even have drove over here because I don't even have my license. And whose fault is that? Mine, 100%. Exactly. But wow, you really going to expose me like that? The one time I forget my wallet? Yes, because because it's not fair. What it's do you mean it's not, not fair? fair? Because in high school, if we were in high school, Isaiah would have made it his freaking mission to not forget Bro, what anything. does high school have to do with anything? Because he was so different in high school, guys. Like, he would just go out of his way to make sure that I am taken care of, 100%. I'm the he same person. He would never person. do something like this. No, you're not. Because now I just feel like he's too comfortable and he just allows me to pay for stuff. Before, I, we would do anything. He'll be like, yeah, no, but I don't want you to pay for that. Even if I'll be like, I'm good, no. He would be paying for it now. It's just like, yeah, whatever, pay for it. I'm also, what happened to being Miss Independent? That I never wanted anyone to pay for anything, right? I could and still I be always pay. I always pay for everything because that's what a good boyfriend should do. The exactly. one time I forget my wallet, the one time I forget my wallet, I'm over here getting crap. For you it. have forgotten you your wallet. You see how she's switching up, guys? Times. You see how she's switching up? Okay, and then what about Apple Pay? 
You could use that. I don't have hand. Apple Pay. I don't have Apple Pay. So, I don't like okay. Apple Pay. Okay, so then he's making up excuses now. This is exactly why I said I missed when he was in high school. He was literally. Bro, what does high school have to do with anything? What? How? Really, what is the difference between me now and me in high school? Please lot, tell me. Please tell. Lot. Let's hear. It. Let's hear. It. I can list everything. You really want me to? Go ahead. I want to. You're painting me as this brand new person. I would love to see how I'm different. And they've been okay. with us. They've been with us since like right when we had gotten out of high school. How? They would have told me like, Yo, Isaiah, you changed over the years, bro. If any. Anything, no, 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 I've that's never not heard. True. No one's ever told me that I've changed, and they for sure would. They would have been the first people to tell me like, "Yo, that's you changed. not true because they weren't with us when we were in high school. High school after we already had done left high school. That's exactly what you. Bro, I was the change. same person since high school. If anything, no, the only not. thing that's different about me now is that I'm more comfortable on camera. That Can is the I only thing that's different. Go ahead, let's hear. Okay, thank you. You painted me as this brand new person. I want to hear this. Because you ahead. are. Go ahead, let's you hear. Are. Let's hear. Go ahead. First and foremost, like I said in the beginning. He used to pay for everything in high school, okay? I still do. So what? That's no, irrelevant. Don't. Moving on. No, you don't. Irrelevant. Clearly, uh, Starbucks irrelevant. Exhibit A. I forgot my wallet. All right. Anyway, the next thing is Isaiah used to send me these long-ass paragraphs in text messages, okay? Long-ass paragraphs telling me how beautiful I am, telling me how much he loves me, telling Bro, me how Bro, we I'm a live princess. together now. Why am I going to send you a text message? How we live I am together. a beautiful goddess and how he wants to worship at my feet. Okay. And I, now. Uh, I, those weren't my words. You You're only. You're hyping yourself me? up. You hyping yourself up now no, because you wanna, I, those were not my words. You want to know what he texts me now? Only thing he texts me is, "Can you bring me the white bees?" Literally, he'll be sitting on the toilet, and that's the most beautiful romantic text message I will get. Bro, that's called okay? that's called uh, those that's soulmates right there. That's no, what that's called. People, no. some people wish that they could like have their significant other like, "Yo, bring me toilet paper" or something like that. People wish for that type that. of relationship. That's how comfortable we are. But why would I go ahead and send you text messages, of paragraphs, and all that? We live together. I tell you all this in person now. What's all of this is just sounding like some buffoonery, to be honest. With that, you. No, wait, everything you're saying sounds like buffoonery. No. Yeah, okay, bro. You're making excuses. Okay. Anyway, the next thing is you know what he used to be mad freaking affectionate and he used to love me and cuddle me and another thing he used to watch movies with me all the time say up throughout the whole movie now i put a movie on he's like bro so all right not, i'm not gonna lie no i'm not gonna lie i do be falling asleep with the movies mm. i'm not gonna lie 100 but we are way more busier now than what we were six years ago so obviously i'm more tired now and i'm gonna fall asleep no. Yeah, that's just I'm just I'm gonna fall asleep. I'm not gonna deny that one. But what does that have to do with me being a brand new person? Because Try to make it seem like I switched up since high school. Dude, in that high doesn't school, even make sense. In high school, he would have taped them peepers open. No, he I wouldn't. If I'm, tired, if I'm tired, I'm tired, I'm going to sleep. If I'm tired, I'm going to sleep. No. I'm not taping nothing. Not true. Okay. Not all right, bro. true. Alright, bro. Alright, you see what I mean? These are all excuses. I just missed Bro, everything you're saying is irrelevant. And they know it too. Like, yo, guys, you you guys would have been the first one to tell me like yo you changed over the years if anything i am way more comfortable now than i've ever been with like my life like i'm just more open about everything now i'm not as timid as i used to be that's the only thing i would say that i changed about myself everything else though is 100 percent the same and you're over here trying to say hey you changed i like you i like you being in high school high school you were in high school you, you were tell me text messages you I, were. I am I flabbergasted and by your responses right now honestly. bro i'm flabbergasted but what you trying to say how i changed like that don't even make sense that don't even make sense. Over here, I miss you when you're in high school. Bro, what? You miss a 16-year-old? You miss when I was, like, scrawny? and Like, bro, I don't get it. The only thing that's changed, honestly, is my weight. Boy. I gained 40 pounds since high school. That's the only thing that's ever changed about me. And you're over here trying to tell me, I miss you when you're in high school. I'm the same person. If anything, I'm just a little thicker. Oh, my gosh. Relax. You no, to... bro. You got me on a rant now. Like, you're over here trying to tell me I'm different. I'm not different. I'm the same. I'm just heavier. You're about to pop the blood vessels in your eye. You good? Let me right. see. Let me see. Bro. Your ears got steam coming out of me. Look at that. <laughs> Babe, it's a prank. I'm kidding. <laughs> Do you just like getting me amped up, right? And they know I got high blood pressure. Bro, they know I got high blood pressure. Now you over here trying to silence me. Like, no, bro, I'm woke. You look like the airhead balloon. You're so red. That's, you trying to come at my head size now. See, you the one with the big head. <gasps> Ooh. I do have a big head. That's not funny. You don't got a head. Your head, like, your head is actually proportionate. <laughs> I don't got a head. <laughs> <laughs> your head is actually proportionate to your body. I think my head's too small for my body. What? I feel, I feel like my head's too small for my body. All right, we're not talking about this right now. <laughs> All right, Infinite Fam, so clearly we got him good with that prank. That was freaking hilarious. Guys, he got so amped up. Bro, you know it's easy to get me amped up with anything in life, and you know I got high blood pressure, yo. 
They know that too. <laughs> All right, whatever. Let's just end this right here because my cousins no, no, are harassing me. I want to make a disclaimer. Guys, I don't be yelling. I feel like a lot of you guys think I be yelling a lot of times. I just talk very aggressively and loud. That no. I, I don't be yelling. You were yelling today. All right. Anyway, it is time for today's post notification shout out. Today's post notification shout out goes out to Just Queen Stuff. Per. <laughs> per. <laughs> he said per. Thank you for your love and support. Isaiah and I love you. If you want to. Wait, wait, wait. We're supposed to be vlogging. No, we're not. <laughs> oh my God, bro. Team Denise, period. Hi, right, yo. Whatever. You ain't getting none of my muffins. I figured you would catch on when I'm doing the freaking outro. I, You know, I'm a little delayed. Oh my goodness. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. And with all that being said, we'll catch you in the next one. Love you, Infinite Fam.